Hey, Pastor Charles coming to you today. I wanted to share a couple of uh, scripture uh, verses with you related to Christ and him being born. You know, we could look at the Old Testament. We could look at scripture and prophecy in the Old Testament and clearly see that Christ is the Messiah. These things were written hundreds and hundreds of years before Jesus was born, but they are clear identifiers of Christ as the Messiah, right? So I want to first share with you uh, scripture, uh, Micah 5, 2. This scripture tells us where the Messiah was going to be born, right? Micah 5, 2 says, but you, Bethlehem, Ephrathah, through, though you are small among the clans of Judah, out of you will come from me one who will be ruler over Israel, whose origins are from of old, from ancient times. This scripture right here, Micah 5, 2, tells us that the Messiah, the ruler of Israel, the ruler will be born in Bethlehem. And then, and then, if you can imagine the very same year that Mary became pregnant, the Virgin Mary became pregnant with Jesus, is when King Herod calls for a census where everyone had to go back to their hometown and be counted for a population. So they know how many people are in the kingdom. And Joseph, who Mary was betrothed to, who, who Mary married, um, uh, he was from Bethlehem. His family was from Bethlehem. So they had to go there and that's where Jesus was born. It's not coincidental. It's not coincidental. Another, another prophecy is that Jesus will be of the line of David. And when you look at Matthew chapter 1, you see that Jesus is of the line of David. Right? So uh, first scripture, Micah 5, 2, Jesus would be born in Bethlehem. And we know Christ was born in Bethlehem. We look at Isaiah 7, 14. It says, um, therefore, the Lord himself will give you a sign. Behold, the virgin shall conceive and bear a son and shall call his name Emmanuel. A virgin given birth is a miracle. It is not a common instance. It's not a common practice, right? We even see in Matthew chapter one in the New Testament that Joseph was going to send Mary away because he thought that's crazy. A, a virgin cannot give birth. But an angel visited Joseph, and it made him um, reconsider and say, she is a virgin. This is the Messiah. And um, stick with Mary and marry her, right? And that's what Joseph did. So these two scriptures, we can see two um, miraculous things about Christ who tell us that, that Jesus is the Christ, because one, he was born of Bethlehem. Two, he was of the line of David. Three, he was born of a virgin, right? And scripture doesn't lie and pretend that's a, a common thing. It doesn't, you know, say, of course he was born of a virgin. Um, uh, it tells us he would be born of a virgin, but even Joseph had doubts until the Lord visited him. And um, our sermon this week is on Matthew chapter one. Uh, please listen to that. I hope you're encouraged to believe in Christ. Look at the prophecies about Jesus in the Old Testament. And it'll give you further confidence. In the description, I'm going to put a link um, to a page from Jews for Jesus that talk about all the different prophecies about Christ. 40 prophecies about Christ in the Old Testament that give them... Jewish people, great confidence that Christ is the Messiah. All right. So thanks so much for watching. I hope you're encouraged and I hope you believe in Jesus Christ this holiday season, this Christmas season and beyond. God bless.